here. Welcome back to Faith Family Fashion. Today I have another thrift haul for you guys. I can't believe it. I wasn't anticipating going thrift shopping, but I ran into some really great deals. So stay tuned and I'll show you what I got. Okay, first I have a couple of clearance finds. Um, and I just kind of include those in with my thrift haul because usually the clearance finds are just super rock bottom prices. I hit the clearance section of a store before I look anywhere else. You know, my hair looks really flat, y'all. <laughs> fix it here. A little better. Okay. Mesh my lipstick to my shirt. It's a little bright. Too bright? We'll just deal with it. Okay, so school is starting here. By the time you see this, it will have already started. So we were out school shopping for Nick. Um, I didn't take you with us because we were looking for just a few pieces, to be honest. Uh, it is still hot here. It is still going to be hot here for quite a while, all the way up through October, probably. So, yeah, just a few things. We're picking up brand new. He can still wear his shorts and things he's been wearing this summer for the first part of school. And we'll just slowly pick him some things up. Uh, I am thinking about doing a video and showing you guys what I did pick up for him. Uh, maybe as he wears them, I'll take a picture of them and then I uh, will just do a short little video because, you know, he's a teenage boy, uh, just turned 13, and I know all the videos out there are about girls and what they're wearing, but it is really hard as a mom of just boys to go, okay, there's only so many options. So we might do that, but for this video, okay, so we were at Penny's. I love pennies, but have you ever noticed that certain pennies are just better than others? So there is one way all the way over across town near the outlet stores that we went to that is, I love this thrift store. This thrift store? No, I love this pennies because their clearance section is huge. Now saying that, I only got one thing for myself and it's very basic, but I love it. It is just this white shirt. It is Worthington. I don't know if you're able to tell the material I love the material this is made out of. This shirt was originally $20 and it was on sale for like $5 and some change and I had a coupon. I ended up getting it for like $3 and some change. So it's just a basic white shirt. But I don't know about you, I have a really hard time finding a really good basic white shirt that I can wear on its own. Like I can put this on and I can wear this as my shirt. I don't have to put on a cami underneath it. I can put it on and wear this with my pants and go. Any other white shirts, I find that they're so see-through and I'm so self-conscious that I'm layering a tank underneath the white shirt. And here in Texas, I can get really hot. So, I was pretty excited. They actually had it in black too. So, I'm thinking this next weekend we may run back out to that same area, pick up a few more things that I seen on clearance that I didn't get, and maybe I'll get the black ones. But let's see if it says anything particular. It just says Worthington and Polar Bear of all things. And I got it in a large because I didn't know if it was going to shrink. There it is if you're interested. So yeah, I got that. Love that. And then the other thing I got, it's actually not for right now really. Um, these are at Walmart and these are on sale and they are their uh, jeggings. They're time and true. Looking for the tag. They're time and true. Okay, these are black. These are just black leggings. They kind of have that jean look to it. See, like this. All the way down. Nice and opaque. So you, they are not going to stretch out and you see something underneath. So they look like jeans, really cute. I love, love, love these for winter because I like to wear big long sweaters and long sweatshirts over them to come way down. So that is, I love winter and fall. That's my favorite time of year. Here we go. Okay, so they were on these little hangers like this. So they were on these little hangers and here we go. I got large in all of them. I always feel, I want them to fit. I don't want them to roll down. I don't want them to stretch too thin. So these are called, they were all called capri leggings, but still for us, that's going to be fine. I'm short. Capri leggings still go to my ankles, okay? Uh, but if you're going to wear these in the winter and fall, wear boots, knee-high boots over them. Nobody knows they only go down so far. So yeah, so these are great 
or like those big giant sweatshirts that I've been getting. I have two now. I have a pink one and I have a black one. Um, so look really cute over these. They kind of go down to the knee. So I got that. And then I got one pair. Oh, I didn't tell you. So then I got this pair that actually looks like jeans. Now this doesn't have the sticker on it. The black pair and this pair both had, I think I pulled the tag off, that's what I did. Both had this tag on it. So the Time and True, they're uh, normally $11.96. There we go, it is the Capri Leggings. This is the same tag that the black pair had on it. These actually look like blue jeans, so these are jeggings. But no, uh, just pull-ons, right? Really comfortable material, super cute. And again, you know, these are these are long for me. So these will go down to my ankle, if not further. These are actually rolled up a little bit on the end. How cute is that? Super, super cute. $3 a piece. You've seen that $11.96? These were on the clearance racks for $3 a piece. To me, this is fall wear. So I don't really know why they would clearance these out, unless they're going to be doing away with them. I don't know. So that is my new stuff. Now, like I said, I had no intention of thrift store shopping. And as we were coming back from Penny's and from the outlet stores, there is a thrift store that I never get to go to because I am never out that direction. It is St. Vincent's. It's a Catholic charity. And they have multiple stores, so if you're here in the Metroplex, it is the one in Plano off of 75. And first thing I see when I walk in is a clearance rack in the thrift store and everything is a dollar. Y'all, I didn't make it off of that rack. I didn't even look through the knickknacks because I knew that I'd spent too much time in there. So these are all bottoms. I didn't see any tops. And I paid a dollar a piece for every one of these. So let me show you what I got. I'm pretty excited about these. Okay, I don't own one of these. I did, I used to, but I think it's too small now. And this is by Casual Corner Annex. And it is a skirt. Look how awesome that is with some black tights. How cute, it actually is a little big. So I am thinking I'm gonna pull it up high-waisted and get me a big wide belt. Oh, I would really love to find a big patent leather, black patent leather belt. Uh, or I may take it over and see if my mom can put into the seam and bring it in a little bit for me. So yeah, and on the sides, it's got a little pleat on each side. How cute is that? I didn't try anything on. If it looked remotely like it was my size, I grabbed it. I haven't washed these yet because I'm probably gonna wash all of these on hand wash and probably hang most of them up. So there is that one. Now another skirt I got that I'm in love with. This is called Stephanie Thomas. I don't know who it is. Again, this one is a little big, but I love it and I wanna wear it high-waisted with a big belt and a t-shirt, maybe even that white t-shirt. But it is, let me show you, it is this. So it's nice and thin and flowy. It's so cute, I don't know if you can tell. But back here, it actually does have a little slit in the back. Super sexy, look at the bottom. What is that, it's just that sheer kind of material. Um, but it is lined, so it is lined, so you're not seeing nothing through it, but it is sheer with your, uh, you know, it's just so pretty. I think, I've been seeing, so many pictures of people wearing these, wearing them high, with a t-shirt, with a big belt. What I have to throw next is belts. I look for belts, I don't find them. The girls over at Fab for Less, they find belts all the time. Uh, Thrifters Anonymous, they find belts all the time. I don't find cute belts at all, ever. So your girl may have to start buying belts. But I like this, I'm excited about this. It's nice and thin, dress it up with some beautiful heels, or what if I wore it with just the t-shirt, super high-waisted, you know, really high-waisted, just, you know, and uh, with a with a big, cool statement belt, and maybe even wear it with some, with some cool little tennis shoes, even. I don't know, what do y'all think? Tell me what you think. Tell me how you would wear either one of those skirts, okay? I need all the help I get. Okay, the rest of these are pants. These I love. 
Um, all of these, I know I'm not showing you tags, so there at uh, St. Vincent's, they have this uh, stamp. So as long as it has this funny looking little red stamp on it, then it's a clearance item and it's for a dollar and everything. Every piece of these was originally $3.99. So these are a pair of loft linen pants. I do not own anything linen and I don't know why, but I am so excited about these because I can still wear these. These are nice enough. I can wear these to work. Get these out and look at the bottoms are so cute. They come down here and they've got these little ties. So they tie across on the legs. So these are cute. You know I love a black pant. There's a lot of them here. Couldn't pass them up. Linen. Ann Taylor Loft for a dollar. I mean, really? So yeah, I can't wait. These are being washed and laundered and steamed. And I'm wearing these this week. I'm excited for those. Um, let's see. Okay, so these are gray. <laughs> And these are apartment nine. And they are a capri dress pant. So they are gray with a little faint um, pinstripe in it. I don't know if you can see it. Uh, they got little pockets here. It's a flat front. It is flat pockets on the back. Again, I am short, so capri length pants. And all I want's over here. The pre-length pants for me actually come right above my ankle, maybe an inch, inch and a half above my ankle. So I will still be able to wear capri-length pants on into the early part of fall because it's still going to be warm here. So yeah, just a straight leg capri dress pant, which is just something nice and different for work. I had several and you know, it was just time to retire them and go find some new ones. So this one is... I don't know this name, y'all tell me if you know this. Hennies, H-E-N-N-E-Y-S, Hennies. Do you recognize that label? I haven't looked anything up, so if I didn't recognize it, I didn't look it up. Again, this is just a pair of black capris. These are a little longer than the others, so flat front, no pockets on the back, got felt loops, just a really good pair of black dress trousers. They are ankle length, so where the others are actually above my ankle. Um, and these are really nice. These are really nice. Um, this pair, I think, is a tiny bit tight. Um, so, your girl's on a weight loss journey, so hopefully these will fit really soon because I really do like them. Uh, these are investments, which I've heard of that, and I don't know where. I don't know if that's a Dillard's or Macy's or where, but I know I've heard of that. It could be, I don't know. So if you know where that is, leave me a comment. But these are a gorgeous black pinstripe dress pant, and they are kind of ankle length on me. So these are meant to be a little cropped, and they are really, really nice. There's nothing wrong with any of these. There's nothing wrong with any of these. They are in perfect condition. Um, it was just a clear the rack sale. So they were still taking stuff and putting it on this rack while I was there. So I would kind of wait a few minutes and I'll put some more stuff in and look through real quick and see if I seen something. But these are just, they're perfect. They are perfect and they were a dollar. Y'all, I never hit these sales. You got Helen down in South Texas, Houston area, and she gets stuff for a quarter and 50 cents a piece. I never, ever, ever get a sale like this. So I was pretty excited. Those are all of my $1 items that I show you these. It's just a beautiful black pinstripe trouser. They look really nice for work. I can wear that white shirt with it. I could put a blazer or a cardigan over the top of it. Um, you know, I could even wear that white shirt and wear some cool little white tennis shoes and really kind of have a casual office look. Uh, aside from just your expected dress shirt and high heels with it. You know what I mean? So, um, yeah, this is why I love going to the thrift stores. All of these things are all perfect quality. Nothing wrong with them. Higher end, they're definitely not, you know, like, you know, like 
Walmart brand, which there's nothing wrong with that, but they are just a little higher quality than that. And they were selling them for a dollar a piece. So if you are not hitting your thrift store, get out and go look. So if I wear something and I decide I don't like it, I've only spent a dollar. So I can refresh my wardrobe and constantly bring in new pieces and look and see what I'm not wearing, take those pieces out, re-donate them, or just get rid of them. And I'm not spending a ton of money and I'm able to refresh my wardrobe and even find styles that I normally wouldn't. Speaking of wouldn't, I hit another thrift store. I'm like, okay, so I did so good at St. Vincent's. And I got out, Nick and I have really not done much this weekend at all since it is the last weekend before school. I've been doing some cleaning here at the house, um, changing some pictures. I still gotta paint the walls and stuff. I've not done that. Um, so just uh, grocery shopping and meal prepping and stuff like that. So I'm like, you know what? I wanna run into another thrift store to just see if my, I still having some good luck. So I ran into Thrift Giant, uh, the one over in, I guess it's the Louisville Coppell area. So, I found something that is not clothing. Like I said, initially, I went looking for stuff. Knickknacks, dishes, home decor, stuff like that. Didn't find any of that. I did find this. I love this. This was originally from Hobby Lobby, and it originally was $14, $13.99. Oh, there's a glare. I'm sorry. I just the light. Let me bring her up. Look at her. Isn't she pretty? Look, just this fashionista, right? Now, if you have been watching me for a while, you know that there was a video that I did a while ago, and I will try to link it. If I can't link it up in the iCards, I will link it in the description box down below, where I did a collab. I participated in a collab, and it was uh, showing some of your favorite thrifted items. So, some of my all-time favorite thrifted items are two Barbie pictures that uh, are from Z Gallery. These were like a hundred and something dollars a piece, and they had two of them at Goodwill, and I got them for fifteen dollars a piece. I love them. I would love to have the entire collection. Um, if I have a chance, maybe I'll insert some pictures. Uh, I love these photos uh, or these pictures, these prints. So this I thought would go along with it. There we go. Under the glare. So I thought this would go along with it. The only thing is, those are really. Those are silver frames, so I haven't decided if I'm going to reframe her in a silver frame or I may actually just take her out of the frame and paint this silver so that it does match the other prints, at least in color of frame. I don't know. What do you think? What do you think of her? I love the fashion prints and pictures, and I just, I'm so fascinated by that. I wish I could, like, draw all this out myself, but not that talented. Okay, so that was $3.99. Oh, you can't see it, but apparently there was a little X up in this corner. There was no price. So I had to ask for the price, so they called the manager over. The girl was says, there's an X there, so that means there's another one. What? You don't understand. This line that I stood in was all the way at the back of the store. Everybody was shopping. Um, and I'm like, oh, you're kidding me. And I'm like, where I found it, there was not another one of these pictures. This was the only one. I will go back another day and I will scour all the photos, all the photos, all the pictures, and see if I can find the mate to this one. Because they gave me this one for $3.99. So I thought that was a really good price, seeing that it normally, oh, there's the tag, normally was $13.99 from Hobby Lobby. So I found a lot of home Hobby Lobby home decor in thrift stores. Okay, and so this is my bag from Thrift Giant. Um, let's see, green and yellow were half price, but this was blue and this was $3.99 and I could not pass it up. If you watched my last thrift haul, if you have it, I will leave it at the very end of this video. Go watch it. I found some awesome things in that video and one of the things I found, I'm going to sneeze, I'm sorry. One of the things I found was a, um, this is by Lee of all things, I would never have guessed was a um, cardigan that was a flannel print. And I told you guys, I just seen these at Altered State for an enormous amount of money that your girl didn't want to pay. So I found that one and it is kind of a mint green and gray and black. And here, this one is a black and white check. I love black and white check, blue and white check. I just love this. This screams fall and winter to me. So this is one of those open cardigans. I did not bring a hanger. 
This is one of those open cardigans. I cannot wait to wear it. It just drapes open. Uh, the sleeves fold up. Look at this. I love this. As soon as it gets a little cooler, I'm going to start wearing these. Look at that. So I love these. These are usually, it doesn't matter the size. I think they're usually one size. This I think is like a large or an extra large or something. But I love it. It doesn't matter because you're going to be wearing it over something. So this is perfect. And this is actually, I mean, you can do these now. So it's hot outside. If you're wearing your shorts and your tank top, and then you're going to go inside into the movies, into a restaurant, you can pop this over your tank top and you've got a real, and it's not flannel. It actually is just cotton. So it's not super heavy. So this is, I mean, you could get away with wearing it now. But I love it. I can't wait to wear this to me. This means fall. So I can't wait for that one. And then I found another uh, cardigan. And this one, I can't believe this. This one, pull the tag off, was a green tag, $1.99. So I got it half price. That means I got it for $1. a tiny little hanger here. Will this work? This, look, y'all, loft for a dollar, for one dollar, loft. So I got loft pants and a loft cardigan for one dollar each. Tell me you're not thrift, why you're not thrift shopping. Really? Okay, so look at this. Look how pretty this is. This is nice and thin. It does have some little sequins and beading in it. And I really don't see anything wrong with it. It's um, like three quarter length sleeve, like it comes to my elbows. It is so pretty, look at this. So, you've got the little buttons down at the bottom. Can you see those? This is so pretty. Again, you realistically could get away with something like this if you're gonna wear this over something out. It's so pretty. I just, I love the like crochet pattern in it. I love the little beading. And I love that I got it for a dollar. So yeah, I think I may actually take this to the dry cleaners just because of the beading and because of the crocheting. I really don't wanna mess it up. So I think I'm gonna hang on to this one and take her to the dry cleaners. Everything else, I think I'm gonna throw it in there and just do it on a gentle cycle. Um, the last thing I got, I'm a little, you're gonna go girl by. Either you're gonna go, what? Or you're gonna like it, okay? So you're either gonna hate it or you're gonna like it. I have seen this, and I want to say that I have seen this or something similar before. And I debated back and forth whether to get it then. So I decided to go ahead and get it because it was half price, so half of $4.99, so it was around $2.50, right? It is vintage. It is by Peter Nygaard. Y'all know who that is? I don't know who that is. Let me see if I need a little baby hanger here. Um, it is very 80s. It is very retro. I thought it might be kind of fun to just wear it um, a couple different ways. So let me show you, y'all. It's a little wild, but look at this. Y'all see that? I can't. This is doing no justice. Okay, here we go. So it is this red, white, and black pattern. And then we have this very 80s looking woman on it with the hat with a little poof on it. And it is uh, sleeves. I don't think are quite. Yeah, they don't quite go all the way down. Um, so probably three quarters. So what do you think? Do you think it is awful? <laughs> yeah, you can tell me, girl. I'm glad you get that. It's the same thing on the back as it is on the front, <laughs> which kind of puzzles me. I kind of would have thought you would have only had it on one side. So I don't know. I, I, I uh, yeah. We're gonna see, but I just thought it was fun, right? It's different. You're, nobody else gonna have this on. <laughs> so what do you think? Can you see her? Let me get you close so you can see her. Look at her. She's got her red lipstick on. She's got a little pink blush. She got poof on her hat, girl. What do you think? Too much? Maybe? I don't know. <sighs> anyway, I got it. I'm gonna play with it again. It was $2.50. If I decide it's not my style, I can re-donate it. And I'm not out a ton of money. 
So guys, that is it. That is my entire thrift haul and my few little clearance finds. Let me know what you think of my haul. Again, I was totally sucked in by that dollar rack that <laughs> got me. I'm definitely going to make it back over to that thrift store um, more often. I will try to do some videos where I take you guys with me. And now that school is starting and I can kind of get back on a schedule, I will definitely try to put a lookbook together of some of uh, some of my what, how I style these. So I just have to get next help with that. So <laughs> I will do that very soon. Uh, so watch for some more videos. Actually, just we do a little bit of everything here. We do hauls, grocery hauls, cooking, thrift hauls, vlogs where you just see what's going on in my life. So if you have not already, I hope you hit that subscribe button. Become a part of our family. Hit that notification bell. Share and like and leave me a comment and let me know what you think. Is this too much? Too much? I don't know. Anyway, thank you guys so much for spending this time with me. I love spending time with you. Remember to stop and thank God for today because it truly is a gift. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.